Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Moody. Um, I am a videographer photographer based in London and Birmingham. Um, and today is the day that I really have decided to get onto this um, YouTube journey, I guess. Um, trying to put myself out there. Do you know what I mean? Like, um, put my work out there. I've, a lot of friends, family have been on my case about this. Like, Moody, why aren't you putting stuff out there? Moody, she go on YouTube, man. Like, you've got a lot to offer. And especially when I have conversations with people about what I do and how I do it. Um, you generally see people like intrigued and stuff like that. So I've decided to actually create a channel where I'm going to have my travel vlogs videos and then I'm going to have my BTS um, for certain jobs, not every job, obviously. Um, and obviously my personal projects um, that I am going to be working on. I think I'm going to do quite a few this year. Um, and I guess everything surrounding my life and and obviously the whole filming world and stuff um, and it's been it's been a long time coming I think from like two years ago I've been saying like yeah I'm gonna get on YouTube I'm gonna get on YouTube and I still haven't um, until today yeah this is gonna be an interesting one we're gonna go down memory lane to 2015 when I started or oh, basically there's a whole bunch of images um, that we're gonna go through and then there's video too like my first ever video guys i done i looked at my first ever wedding video oh my gosh uh, i could not um yeah it is <laughs> it is rather interesting um i think comparing it to the most recent which was in december when i done a wedding yeah it's it's gonna be it's gonna be lit do you know what i mean like you guys are gonna laugh and then i guess some of you are gonna be inspired because it shows you from from like the start of the journey to where I am after five years. Not saying I've, I'm at a high place or anything, but it shows you the progress over the years and what I've learned here. But without further ado, um, I think let's go to the computer. Now we're going to, oh guys. All right guys, now that we're back on the computer, now I'm just gonna go through all the images and some of my videos. About to go crazy. <laughs> First video, no picture, image. Wow. Um, yeah, just good old photo. You know, just first snap, as you can see, based on the number here. It's the first image ever on this camera. Second image, we are. Yeah. Um, I think I was just trigger happy, just snapping everything and anything, just to showcase the quality of my camera. See, do you know what I mean? Oh, look at that. Do you know what I mean? So, yeah, that's that. Next photo is this one. I thought it was a really nice photo, but obviously, not having the most expensive gear. This guy's blown out here. And then you've got this um, street light covering this. And you've got this cut off. So, now with the knowledge that I have, I would stand back move this way a little bit so that I can see the Millennium and I can see the Birmingham University, um, Birmingham City University just there and then snap it as like a big image pushed all the way back to show the whole street and everything. Um, next image, ooh, 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 that is bright. Anyway, <laughs> this image is hella overexposed. Um, naturally, I wouldn't use this photo at all, um, but I think on this new camera, my A7, I can bring back, you know, some of these highlighted spots um, because it's got high dynamic range and then, you know what I mean, you can you can bring it back, you know, you can try, but if that was the only photo you have, but that's why I'm always like, sometimes take two photos, look at them, and then take one slightly darker just in case. Wow, I say I'm a lot, don't I? This is before the tram was running was when it was just obviously everything was being constructed and stuff oh yeah 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 when you asked this was like the little you know paradise circus go through the thing you know by the library come back you know right in the city like it was like the place that there was like the little strip that joined broad street and and obviously like the main city like obviously boring and 
Grand Central. This is a photo of obviously the Birmingham City Library. I really like this photo. It's got a little bird in there, you know what I mean? Um, the exposure is right, you get reflection from the buildings across the street. These are giving these highlights. Um, obviously managed to capture the whole building. I would have wanted this tree to be in the shot too, but you know what, it's all right. Um, and then this is when I was doing the photo in camera, guys. And the flash was on, that's why you can see all this and look at how dirty my phone is. But anyway, this is somewhere in Birmingham. Um, but yeah, here we are, Grand Central. Before the work had been finished, and they're still kind of putting this stuff up and you know, the inside was still being done and stuff. So yeah, now we're gonna go to videos. Oh, guys, this is painful. All right, cool. Guys, this is where. <laughs> really? Bro, the shake is too much. No. Oh, okay, smoothed out. All right. Don't know about this speed ramp, to be fair. These days I didn't have a gimbal guys, so like everything was handheld. The shake is obviously trying to, you know when you, when you use that software, that um, warp stabilizer in Premiere Pro or, you know what I mean, just stabilizing the shot. Um, my first ever live show that I filmed. Oh yeah, you definitely should check these guys out. Lit people, great music. Um, I done this with my boy Mike and we had I think we had five cameras but let's count the angles guys let's count oh, okay look at that B roll don't know what that is so one okay from the right a center two audio is bad Midi, ready ready okay that's two the same two angles oh look at me in the little corner to the third angle oh yeah there he is oh that looks decent you know fourth angle i'm looking for that Do you know what guys i'm looking for oh yeah there we go fourth from the other side oh look at me <laughs> oh this was a wedding i did guys oh my gosh this is when i kind of just figured out how to use my drone Oh my gosh, wow, that drone was like three years old. Sugar. Yeah, I guess it was time to upgrade. Mm, mm. Mm. Okay, yeah, this is when I now had an idea. Do you know what I mean? Like, I had something to use to stabilize everything. Sorry, 17 and then 2018. All right, cool. I enjoyed making this video. Um, it was like bank holiday, I think. And this is like my first ever lookbook. You know what I mean? Mine came with the source, directing and everything, like telling um, Cooper, that's her name, she's a really dope um, stylist. Um, yeah man, we created something that kind of created a little buzz, you know, and people were like, ooh, come on, eh, I'm, nah, I'm even gassing my own work, you know, you go back, mm, mm. I like this, I like this, well done son, well done son. Copyright, 
is let's remove that part in my a hey, my brothers my brothers um oh this was lit man um i can't really play the music guys because it's copyright and all of that all of that um yeah it makes sense more it makes more sense with the music um oh like yo who did i think i was you know let's go with this one yeah, obviously my night plans KB, you know what I mean? Graphics, come on, let's go. Now, Zimbabwe is not hard to have fun, man. I don't care. Look at us. Look at us. Oi. Come on. Uh, a couple of Nigerians in there. I think this is one of the videos that kind of made me blow a little bit more. Ooh. Guys, I can't do it again. Can't lock it off because of copyright, because otherwise it's going to be long. Um, but yeah, I really like it. It was a pleasure working with Gracie. She's really lit, dope person. Um, and you know, the fact that we even created this and she she had an input but it wasn't long like we just got on understood my vision understood what she wanted got the outfits in you know what i mean everything came through looked good and i have to say a couple opportunities have come because of this video video ends i like this closing shot that eye contact makes a statement come on this is when i kind of became a cinematic videographer for 2018 when I understood, you know what I mean? Like editing to sound, you know what I mean? Like everything happening. Ooh. Oh, yeah. By the way, this video was part, parts of this video was featured in a BBC um, broadcast. And they even sent me the form to be like, yo, can we use your stuff? Can you just give us the go ahead to use your stuff? Blah, blah, blah. Mum was gassed. Okay, 2020. One of my favorites for 2020 was this actually. One like Ben. Ooh. YouTube intro, guys. Come on. I need someone to do a YouTube intro like this of me. But. Lit. But anyway. Um, that was 2020. I'm not going to show a lot in 2020. Um, if you want to see more, head over to my Instagram. I'm just going to give you a little sneak peek of 2021. Whew. All right, cool. That's it, guys. The other video I won't be able to show you. I think let's just wait for it to come out then show you guys. But with that being said, thank you very much for staying till the end. I love you all. Um, subscribe, like. Um, share it with friends and those that you think may need this I'm gonna be doing a couple tutorials in terms of like how I edit thank you very much for watching it's been lovely all my love good people peace